guys! Today we're gonna make Hawaii school supplies! To make your school days more interesting and fun! That's right! Now, what should we begin with? Since you've already bought this notebook, maybe we can start with it? Great idea, Sammy! But first, preparation! Okay! We need to choose nice and soft fabric. I've already transferred the outlines of all the pieces and now we need to cut them out! I guess we need scissors for this! Right! Always be careful with them, guys! For this craft, we need to make four paws and two ears. Each piece consists of two pieces which we are gonna sew together from the back side and then turn inside out. Oh, it will take forever! I can show you how to do this. What do you think? Sure! I even brought this pretty thread for you! Thanks! And here's the needle! Guys, don't forget about safety while working with sharp objects. Needles are not toys! Or feel free to ask an adult to help you at this stage. You don't need the scissors anymore, am I right? No, no, no! I'll need them in a sec! What for? We've already cut out everything! Yes, but the scissors can be used in many ways. For example, for turning the piece inside out. Ah, now I get it! So clever! Let's talk more work, Sammy. Hup, wow, looks so cool! Ugh, I'm almost done too! Now we'll open the very last page to glue our pieces like this. Guys, safety comes first, so be very careful with the glue gun. Phew, phew, I finished my part of the work, finally! Guys, I hope you don't mind a little bit of craft magic. Wow! How do you like it? Sue, it's amazing! But I was thinking, maybe we can figure out how to close it tightly? I don't want everybody to see my drawings! You were wearing the solution on your forehead all this time! Huh? Yeah, that's what I meant! <laughs> hmm, something is missing. Huh? Now we're talking! I was working on a project too! Promise not to laugh! Wow, Sammy, you did a great job! Yay! Thanks, Sue! Let's test it! There is no notebook without a bookmark! You're right! When you study, you can't waste a minute to search where you finished your notes! Huh! It worked! Guys, you would be surprised how easy it is! You can draw any animal you want! By the way, Sammy! Yeah, I'm here! You said something about your drawings! I think it's time to show off your art skills! I can do it even with my eyes closed! We will see! Oh, and one more thing! Can you please keep the bear theme? So the bookmarks are in one style? I'm sure you'll make a cool bear! There are so many of them! Guys, we need to make two openings here. But don't forget about being very careful while working with the cutter. Sue, try to guess what bear I'm making? Hmm, according to the white color, it can be... The polar bear! Am I right? No, <laughs> but you're lucky to have one more guess. Sammy, maybe you can just show us what you've got there? It's a panda! Guys, give us a thumbs up if you guessed that! What about taking another look at our pretty set? What are you doing, Sue? Don't answer! I'll figure that out! Well, well, well! Two tiny stars! And a kind of... Sammy, I can't see anything! So do you have any idea what it is? Maybe it's a brooch? Did you forget we're making school supplies today? Not accessories! Sue, don't keep us in suspense! It's the cutest paper clip ever! Pay attention, guys! You need to attach a clip to the fabric, not just put it in. As for me, it's not kawaii enough. But if we add some more details... What about some sprinkles? Our star is gonna look like a cupcake! Like this one? Oh, Sammy, I can see you have nothing to do. I wish someone could make another paper clip. Sue, why do you need someone when you have a slime like me? <laughs> it's so easy to trick you. Ask an adult to help you at this stage if you want.
And the last touch. I haven't heard Sammy for ages. Where is he? Sammy? I'm here with a bunny clip. Oh, guys, would you look at these cuties? something else. We just need to stuff it. Guys, we've already made so many school crafts. Subscribe to our channel if you want to watch them all. Now we can fill this piece up this way. And a little bit more to the other one. Oh, it's so exciting to watch you turn a plain piece of fabric into a pretty cute craft. It makes me thirsty. Don't throw that can away, Sammy. And check out these little eyes. A can? But it's empty! Yes, it is. But we're trying to recycle as much as we can, remember? It's very important for our environment. Because if we're not going to do this, who will? Yeah, you're right. There are so many of us, but there's only one planet Earth. That's exactly what I was talking about. Now, a little more sewing. So we can also use this juice straw. Sammy, can you please make the legs from it? Who's the fastest crafter in the world? You are, of course, just in time. And the final touch. Yay, now we're talking. Check out these cute legs. Sue, don't take it personal, but I can't understand what animal that is. It's a cute little lamb, see? He is so sweet, Sue. Guys, let's have a closer look at him. Guys, we're back! This time, I've decided to work on the eraser. Sue, check out this old beauty blender! What a color! Maybe we can use it. Here I go! Oh, I'm so sorry! Now it's ruined! Hey, Sammy, don't worry. I was gonna cut that anyway. A bit of magic? Snap! Check this out, guys! And the last touch to make it much more kawaii! We need the maximum of kawaii for this craft! And we've got it! <laughs> Guys, this is gonna be our last craft for today! That's why you asked for so many sparkling details! And while I'm busy here, can you glue them? Sure thing! We need to figure out the way to close our unusual binder. This time, instead of Velcro, we'll use magnets. Here we go! Looking good! How long should I wait for you, Sue? I'm already done! Huh? It looks like you enjoyed making this! Check out this cute little buddy, guys! Let's give him his paws! One goes here. And another one goes right here. Like this. Now we can close our binder. Oh, guys, look! If the binder is closed, it seems like our raccoon is closing his eyes. Like he's playing hide and seek. It's too cute to be true. Let's look at all of our crafts one more time. <laughs> Hi guys! Today we'll help Sammy be able to take everything he needs to paint a picture while traveling. Hi, Ford! Sue, are we going to make 
make another organizer. We are, Sammy, but it's going to be pretty unusual. Your travel keys for stationery will be as light as can be, and it will have a shape like this. By the way, guys, on our channel you can find a lot of videos about how we make different organizers. Whoa, that's a lot of fun! Uh-huh. We need to make our travel keys neat and bright, right? We'll use some glue. <laughs> make way, Susie! Guys, you should always be very careful with the glue gun. Thanks, Sammy. I'll take it from here. Bring me some paint, please. I'll bring all of my favorite colors! <laughs> now we'll carefully place this cardboard template right here and press a little bit. Great! Then we'll use more glue on this side. Don't be stingy with the glue. We want our construction to be sturdy. Guys, now we'll attach one more piece of foam. It should look a bit like a sandwich. <laughs> Done! As you have already guessed, we'll need two of these pieces. <laughs> Did you miss me? <gasps> Sammy, you keep scaring me today! I brought you the most beautiful paint colors that I could find! But don't use all of them, Sue! Or I won't have any of them to take on my trip! <laughs> <laughs> I won't, Sammy, I promise! Guys, this will be the front part of our travel case. Let's make it look outstanding! And that's it! Awesome! Now let's deal with the zipper. Since we're making a travel key, it should be able to close well. Oh, Sue! I can't wait for my journey to begin! It's been a while since I went somewhere that far. I hope they're waiting for me there! If I were you, Sammy, I'd start making a list of what I should take with me right away. I like being prepared for everything in advance. Don't you guys? Then give us a thumbs up! Oh, you're right, Sue. I've got to start packing. <gasps> Stop! Uh, where's my Nutella? Ah, uh, Sammy, Sammy. <laughs> okay, guys. This is what I've done with the zipper. It is sort of surrounded by foam now. Our next step will be attaching it to the front part of our future case. Like this. Now comes the back part. As always, guys, be careful with the hot glue. Apply it straight to the edge of this piece and attach it right here. Wow, Sue! My pencil case is turning out so cool! Sue, you know how much I like lots of compartments, right? <laughs> oh, please. Go wash your face, little sweet tooth, before you get the crap dirty. Of course I know everything about Sammy. That's why I have this little outside pocket, guys. It's pretty much made the same way as the main case was made, but it only has one cardboard foam side. Let's glue it. We'll attach it to our case right here. Okay, I'm clean. Are you happy now? Wow! I like this backpack, Sue! But don't you think that it's kind of too big for my back? <laughs> You're still getting my idea a bit wrong, Sammy. Could you bring me a pencil? What do you mean I'm getting something? <gasps> What's that? We'll use hard cardboard this time. We need to make a hole in the middle of each wheel for the chassis. But be very careful with any sharp objects, guys. Mm. You can always ask an adult to help. Now we gotta make the same openings in the foam circles. There's the pencil, Susie. I also brought the sharpener just in case. We don't need it this time. Today, we'll use the pencil as the chassis. You see? But first, we need to finish with the wheels. Let's glue the colorful pieces of foam onto these cardboard circles from both sides. Done! Sue, did I do everything right? 
Wow, Sammy, you're a mind reader! All that's left to do is to attach the wheels to this piece from both sides. And the chassis is ready! Susie, let me do something else for you! I feel guilty that you're helping me! And I can't even take you with me as a plus one to that celebration! Don't be, Sammy! You know that I'm always glad to get myself busy with another craft! Of course! I know what I should do! What? Sammy? Guys, I guess we'll be right back. <sighs> Susie, there. These are the stands. Oh, take a breath, Sammy. Thank you. Guys, check out what Sam made. These stands are thick enough. Let's put them in their place. They were made the same way as the wheels. I just used a couple of extra layers of foam. <laughs> and you did great. Basically, all that's left to do is to make a handle for our case. I've got it covered! Welcome one perfect handle from foam! Sammy, that's not what I was talking about! Although this will come in handy! I meant that in order to be portable, our case really needs a folding handle. We'll make it from two bamboo sticks and two popsicle sticks. Line run, all done! <laughs> was that any magic spell? I'm an expert in that! Hello, me, Susan! Checking in and checking out! Our crowd's the best! Sammy, your magic is something. Am I right, guys? Then give us a thumbs up and we'll continue. Sammy, how's your packing process going, by the way? Are you planning to take a lot of stuff with you? A hat and sunglasses are all I need there. And that pencil case, of course. <laughs> oh, Sammy, you're the readiest slime I know. <laughs> Guys, we've made this thingy from foam, and now we need to glue it right here. It'll block the handle from falling out. We'll do it this way. <laughs> it all works! Terrific! Okay, our travel case is pretty much ready. Wanna see how it looks from the inside? Wow! I like it too! There's a lot of space in here! Everything should fit inside! I think it's time to go get my stationery! I have a long list of things! Oh, really? How long is it? Hmm... Well, then we'd better make a few adjustments right now! And... Hop. Perfect! Let's attach a piece of foam, bent like this, right here! Great! Now we have even more space in here! Oh, I won't, Sammy. Check this out! Whoa! What will we place in between those little thingies? Hmm, let's try this. Perfect! Now we can glue a white strip of foam on the top of these little dividing thingies. There you go. Guys, we need to make a few cuts right now. Be very careful with scissors. You should try to cut the foam right in the middle of each little space. We like working with foam while making different crafts. You can check out the videos about that on our channel. Oh, that's right! <laughs> and a final cut. Done. Just look how easy it is to put a pencil in this place! And take it out when you need it! Let me fill this compartment! <laughs> it took me a second! Looks awesome! Great job, Sam! But let's take one more tiny step to decorate it! Don't we speed up a bit? Just check out how much stuff we fit in here! Wow! So awesome, Sue! All my markers are in here! And we actually even have some space left! Not for long. Some post-its might come in handy. They're so colorful and bright! That's my favorite part! We can also place something right here. I thought maybe card holders. Done! <laughs> A few final touches. Do you like it, guys? Then give us a thumbs up by 
the way, Sue. Wanna know what I like the most when we're making different organizers? That you have fewer chances to lose your stationery? No! That you can get creative and decorate your organizer in any way possible! Am I right, guys? Oh, I'm so funny and smart! Oh, you're totally right, Sammy. Getting creative is always the best. And one more thing. Done! I almost forgot to show you what's inside this little compartment. I even made a small magnet place here, so now you have a spot to keep your paper clips. You outdid yourself this time, Sue! Let's check out this travel case for stationery one 